Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh everyone So the first time let me introduce myself My name is Destulan Dahri With student number 21202024 So today I will read a text The Native Americans also known as American Indians Were the initial inhabitants of North America According to their beliefs Some thought, thought their ancestors came from within the earth While modern science suggests they migrated from Asia over the Bering Strait around 50,000 to 60,000 years ago, they were nomadic, primarily hunters who trailed animals, their main food source, as they migrated southward. This early population spread across North America, forming diverse tribes with very varying languages, beliefs, and customs. When Europeans, Europeans arrived, they encountered distinct culture areas, each with its own tribes, sharing certain characteristics. For example, tribes like the Pima and Papago in the southwestern desert had similarities but led vastly, vastly different lives from the Sioux on the plains. The Apaches in the southwest or the Wakitul and Tlingit on the northwest coast geography significantly influenced their way of life the the inhabitants of the northwest coast tripped on hunting and fishing but were not nomadic due to uh, abundant resources they had access to a rich variety of fish from the oceans and rivers as well as ample animal life in the forest this environment also provided materials like wood for various purposes Seasonal hunting way, uh, was a key activity, keeping the tribe busy in certain times, while allowing for creative pursuits during off-season, such as woodworking. In contrast, the tribes of the eastern plains practiced agriculture, agriculture, living in settled communities and cultivating crops. Their homes were constructed from a wood, a stock different from the nomadic tribes of the northwest. They obtained horses from Spanish settlers, aiding their buffalo hunts. The arrival of Europeans brought immense change, leading to conflicts and the loss of not only land but also the core ident identity of Native American societies. The Plains in Indians, for instance, faced the extinctions of buffalo and the loss of their vi vi vital buffalo hunts. Today, while some Native Americans reside in urban areas, many life of On government designated reservations, some tribes have preserved ancestral custom and languages, while others have drifted away from these traditions. Economic disparities exist, with some groups experiencing relative wealth while others rely heavily on government existence. In recent times, many tribes have been striving to reclaim their cultural heritage and identity. They engage in legal battles, battles to regain control over their land and reclaim their essential fishing and hunting rights, which were the foundation of their ancestors' way of life. Okay, I think that's all from me. Thank you for your good attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.